Hi everyone, this is Neha and once again I welcome you all to my YouTube channel about technology. Well guys, have you ever answered the question of what is internet or intranet or extranet? Well I know, answers will be weird. Most of the people don't have any idea about this. That's why today I have brought up a video in which we will try to understand these terminologies in detail and also figure out differences between them. So let's get started. Internet, intranet and extranet are different form of network that were invented to serve different purposes. Both intranet and extranet are kind of network that are derived from a global network that we know as internet. So let us understand internet first. Internet is a network of networks that is made up of large number of independent networks. This network is fully distributed and there is no central controlling unit that decides how packet will route in network, how these independent networks are going to build up or which network is going to connect which one. All these are business decisions and are taken wisely by the network operator themselves. The network operator is one who built and controls specific network. The most important thing that every network operator has to pay attention while creating a network is to ensure that the network provides end-to-end connectivity to its users, which in a big picture ensures that any device can communicate with any other device in the world. So this was all about internet. Now let us get into intranet. An intranet is a private network derived from internet and is used by companies or organizations for their internal communication only. Its main purpose is to let employees of the company securely communicate with each other. With an intranet, the employees of the organization can also access information from company's database. And the last network of our today's discussion is extranet. An extranet is a private network that an organization, company or enterprise share with a third party such as suppliers, vendors, partners, customers, etc. Extranet provide a secured and control access to business information or other operations. Extranet is derived from intranet. Intranet is only available for the member of organizations only. Whereas, extranet is available to members within the organization and also to relevant members present outside the organization. Knowing internet, intranet and extranet in brief, now let us discuss the points on which they differ. If we talk about the purpose, as internet is a global network, it enables communication between the computers around the world. As intranet is a private network designed for companies or organization, it enables communication between the computers within an organization or company only. An extranet is a private network that an organization, company or enterprise shared with a third party such as supplier, vendor, partner, customer, etc. Thus, it enables communication between the computers in an organization and some specific external networks. If we talk about the accessibility, being a global network, internet is globally accessible. Being a private network, intranet is accessible by computers of the organization only. Being a shared network, extranet is accessible to organization and some external members with logins. If we talk about the security, security in internet totally depends on the user of the device connected to internet. The user must have knowledge of what he or she should access over internet and what not. Like, user must avoid clicking suspicious links. Security in intranet is ensured by implementing firewall. Security in extranet can be ensured via firewall and VPN. So if you talk about the security level, internet is less secure, intranet is more secure, extranet is more secure than internet but less secure than intranet. Being a global network, internet is a large network. Being restricted to a company, intranet is a small network. Being restricted to a company and some of its external member, extranet is a smaller than internet but larger than intranet. If we talk about the ownership, internet is made up of large number of independent networks, so nobody owns internet. However, internet is owned by a particular organization or company. An extranet is owned by multiple interrelated companies or organizations. If we talk about the maintenance, internet service provider who build and control specific network are responsible for the maintenance of internet. As intranet is a private network, it is maintained by Chief Information Officer that is CIO of the organization. 
as Extranet is a private and shared network, it is also maintained by the chief information officer of the organizations. If you talk about the policies, the user do not have to agree any policy for using internet. While using intranet, the user have to agree to policies imposed by organization to use intranet. While using extranet, the user have to agree to policies imposed by connected organizations. When it comes to user, anyone around the world with a device that can access internet can use internet. Only the member of organization are authorized to access intranet. When it comes to extranet, members of organization and member of all connected parties can access extranet. If we talk about the type of network, internet is a public network while intranet and extranet is a private network. When it comes to coverage, being a global network, internet covers whole world. Being a private network, intranet is restricted to a specific area or building of the organization. Being a shared network, extranet is restricted to organization and some of its stakeholders. Example of internet is browsing Google, playing online game, online shopping. Example of intranet is a company using internal network to share information with their employees. Example of extranet is company using a network to share information with their stakeholders. So this is all about internet, intranet and extranet. If you like this video, please share this with your friends and family and don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel about technology. Keep checking the channel for further updates and put your comment and queries in the section below. We'll be back again soon with a new video. Till then, take a good care of yourself.